and many students are participating as competitors. It has 5,000 plus campus ambassadors in 133 countries, almost 85,000 students at two seasons, that is previous two seasons, they have participated in English Olympiad all over the world. Now, English Olympiad, Global is working more than 100 non-native English speaking countries in for last seven years very actively. Today, we are going to commence the third season, third season of English Olympiad. As our motto is inspiring leadership, we will be working to provide world-class leaders from the platform where they are preparing them with conviction and care for the post-pandemic challenges so far. English Olympiad awarded 5,000 students, as you could come to know, he has said already that they provide more than 25,000 United States dollars for the students, those who are selected by this English Olympiad. Inspiring stu students to be global citizens, developing international communication skills, improving leadership among youths by practical leading, emphasizing soft skill, spreading the importance of English communications, and developing English among young students. Therefore, now this is the formal part. OK, am I audible? So I have done the formal part. Now, as I had been starting with my speech that I have a dream, the people, those who are sitting in front of me, I can just share one of my experience. In back in 2007, I went to United States of America for a training for almost six months from Bangladesh Army. And you know, most importantly, I was lucky to interact with almost all the capacities where I have interacted with the elite, elite classes of the society and also the very ordinary classes of the society where I was very clear, I was very concise, and also I was very Indeed, in expressing my expressions and my needs. And to my utter surprise, I have seen that those who are lack in their capacities or capabilities to interact in English, they had been lacking even to express their needs. And most importantly, you know, I had been in 22 countries all over the world where I found that English is the only interactive, interactive means of your expressing your hearts asking something very necessary for your livelihood and just to ask some help from any of the people who comes across you. That's why understanding the importance and the necessity of English, why not to organize it as soon as possible? Because I see the dream. I am a dream lover, I am a dream, dream walker. And the way you are sitting today, I wish I could go back 30 years back once I was like six, seven, or eight years of age, eight years of age, or maybe I was studying in primary and secondary level. You know, I can assure you that if you love English, if you practice English, it is going to pay you the most dividends of your life. Now, how to improve upon this? English is not that tough. English is a language where you need only the keen interest and you need regular practice. You know, so many things, so many, so many environments you will find where you will have the scope to interact by English. So love English, learn English, and culture English. What we do, we learn English, but we don't culture English. We don't practice English. You have to practice English. And this is the biggest platform right at this moment in our country, where by English Olympiad, you can find yourself as a brand ambassador in the world platform, that is the global platform. So that's why I request all of you to please remain with these endeavors. I can tell you that it will not only recognize your capabilities, rather it will also enhance your standard. It, will, it is going to give you the biggest platform of your life. Now, let's come to the third benefits. Third benefit is that, you know, at present in the world, there are almost 1.2 million scholarships are offered by various universities, by various higher class platforms of the educational standard. So if you want to venture those, you need to attain certain English standard in your writing capabilities, in your reading capabilities, that is phonetics, and also expressing yourself. So I must request all of you to please, whatever you are trying to learn, 
maintain it, learn it by heart, and culture it. Practice it at your own. With that, I would like to finally, I would like to also give my heartiest gratitude and also I also like to express my heartfelt thanks to the English Olympian Bangladesh for coming all over the, it's a long process and giving us the scope to select our students from Rangpur division for the next round. Wish you all the best. Finally, I would also like to congratulate all of you who will be preparing yourself for the next platform, that is global platform. May Allah bless us all, remain fine, remain healthy, and enjoy your time. Assalamu alaikum.